a potential money spinner, now lying in despair. The money was paid to a contractor who never finished his job. It was a grant from the Rural Development Department. The residents want answers from the government. Our hearts are heavy. By now, children should be benefiting from employment opportunities here. Our nation as well should be benefiting a lot from it. From 2015 until now, this project is at heart. We are suffering while this project is like this. We had hoped that this project would change our lives, but it hasn't. Knowing that money meant for this project was squandered bothers us. There's no fence here and this place is being vandalized. The historical and economical value of this project is not going unnoticed. We believe that it's a very important heritage site uh, which, requires, which requires a lot of attention from the level of the municipality and even from the level of people uh, in general to ensure that when heritage sites are built in communities, people, the people themselves, even before government chips in, but people themselves are in a position to ensure that they jealously guard whatever heritage resource that is available. The provincial government is also ready to guide the Amandlambe community about which channels to follow to secure assistance. Yanga Funani, SABC News, Kwanlambe, Outside Pedi.